welcome here. There's a welcome here. There's a Christian welcome here. Hallelujah. There's a welcome here. There's a welcome here. There's a Christian welcome here. Somebody is welcome here. Everybody is welcome here. There's a Christian welcome here, hallelujah. Everybody is welcome here, welcome here. There is a Christian welcome here. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Ah, oh boy. It's a beautiful morning. Just um, adding up um, my information to share this page. Guys, if you're on, please hit the thumbs up right away. Yeah. And if you can share our page, share it as well on your social media. So that everybody know that we are on and we are raring to go. Yes, yes, yes. That's what it is. It's breakfast live, guys. Yes, man. Ah, uh, boy. Just click on the link to... See how not heroes how how we were making it post. Good morning, good morning, good morning, Mr. Charles E. Duhaney. Your name sounds very familiar to me. Good morning to you. And good morning, Erica Tan. Good morning, Ben Childs. Good morning, Thelma and Easton. We're seeing some new names this morning. So we would love for you to, to just let us know where you're logging on from so that we can give you a personal, a personal shout out, all right? Good morning, Janice Jones. Good morning, Simone Kelly. Prayer kid, morning youth. Morning, morning, morning. Good morning once again to all those who are on. Yes, you see the, the beard are come, it are come, it are come, it are come. The beard is coming on, it's it's getting there. All right, Good. I'm in Topeka, Kansas. Terry Robinson. Topeka is in the house. Hey, Kansas is in the house. Hey, uh, baby, baby, come on, baby. I, I've never, I've never been to Kansas. I, I don't know Topeka. It's, it's. It's all um, strange to me. Topeka is, is like a um, traditional American Indian name. Jamaica, New York. Thelma says New York is in the house. Hey, Brooklyn is in the house. Hey, Queens is in the house. Hey, baby, baby, come on, baby. All right, let me just get to the bottom line. This morning, me and the wife are not really, not, not, not really click. We now say eye to eye. She not looking at my eye, I mean, not looking at her eye. And. What's going on with eye to eye? Eye to eye? Oh, sorry. Excuse everything else. We're seeing eye to eye. You see my eye? Let me look in her eye, see. So we can see eye to eye. I found my truth. See, she not see. See, guys, she's not seeing eye to eye with me. I don't know what's wrong. I feel so hurt. <laughs> Candice Williams, good morning to you. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yeah, so you know what? I have to really and truly applaud us as a couple. Let me tell you something, guys. When you talk about, when you see the celebrities doing social distancing and staying home and stuff, I recently realized that they stay in home, but them house big. One person can be upstairs, somebody can be the den, another person in the movie room, somebody in the gym. You know them big house that we can walk up and down in different, different places. 
our house is small. If me drop off at the kitchen, if me come out of the kitchen, me step out of the kitchen, me step in at the living room. Me can stretch from the bed to open the fridge. The way out the house small. And we have been in here and not been and getting on one another nerves for uh, how much months now the quarantine see what two months or three months two months i don't know no simon you hear the answer there simon simon just pray for you because pray for you odin skill skip sparta good morning to you good morning so, I, 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 I'm, I'm saying i'm saying we have not yet gotten on each other's nerve up to the point i think this morning i have overstayed my welcome oh it's only one month simon come on simon i can't one month one month see can't be one month. i can't one month simon you know long we in here simon you know how long we I in here i have not worked in like two months so it has to be two months. Why feel like two months? Well, I me, me no know. Me get on our nerves now. I think I got on our nerves. So I'm walking on glass wow. this morning. What? It's probably one month, but why feel like one? Cause you there too long. Mm. So pray for us, guys. Pray for us because she has been very gracious and very patient and. Donna Lee Duncan, good morning. Maryland's in the house. Hey, B Moore is in the house. Hey, baby, baby, come on. Let me I tell you how far it got now. It gotten to the point now where I don't even bother come out of my pyjama. I just wear my pyjama the whole day, put it in the wash with my beard, and then you know put on my night clothes, my nether pyjama. I have about four sets of pyjama, and them just keep rotating. Yeah, just wash, wash, wear, wash, wear, wash, wear. Me, all of my new suit them when I buy for God um comedy come show up. Me I send them I'm carrying back all of them to Macy's. Macy trick me. If Macy's did tell me that this quarantine I go keep, me wouldn't buy all of them suit them. Me need back money. Trust me, Ben Child says this 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 makes distance very appreciated for making the heart fun. That Ben, I think her heart is fun to the brim. Right now, her heart is about to stab me. <laughs> oh God. And she not uh, That's the dangerous part, guys. When she's when she quiet, me asleep with the door lock. As, as a matter of fact, I think I'm gonna sleep in Joshua's room today. Yeah. Uh, oh my God, Jatori. Long time I'm not seeing a Jatori. You, you, you're missing in action. Look like all your internet did get quarantined. I never seen about a million years. You understand? But the Lord knows the way through the wilderness. Charles says hello and talk with your partner and make sure kiss and make up. Charles, you, you see any of me ever go so? Then I told you to chop off clean, clean, and I know you so. Kiss and what? Charles, let me tell you what I have to do. I forgot, I forgot to beat the quarantine and go to the street go buy all some roses and get romantic. I come back with all my mask and say, baby, look what I got for you. Roses. I say, I got roses for you. Without my mask. Also. And she said, wait a I say, I beat the quarantine. <laughs> Good morning, N rank. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. All right. Enough of me talking. This morning, the wifey is is rearing to go we are making jamaican color low and donna lisa pick some flowers from donna a rent marine the house no flowers not grow in a rent house rent house yard dry not a flowers only wild bush so this is color loo see there hallelujah praise the lord and if you're jamaican you know that this comes in stocks like you know and you you have to clean it and then cut it up and we did not show you the the cutting up process because i have tons of videos with kalaloo being cut up so yeah yeah man we have some videos with kalaloo cut up in our playlist yeah man for real we have to go look for it but yeah all right, so we make kalaloo rice. We, we have done kalaloo with other stuff and, and you know. Um, kalaloo, it, Johnny says, does it taste like collards? It is a milder version of collard greens. Kalaloo is almost, it, it would be 
in between collard greens and spinach it's somewhere in the middle it's not as soft as spinach but it is not as hard as collard greens all right that's that's a good um and um mm -hmm. and, and, take way less time and it takes super less time to cook just a little bit more time than spinach but way less time than um collard greens all right and you can just quickly saute your your callaloo with um you know your, your your basic seasonings bring bring the seasoning come um and we have in the interest of time we have gone ahead and put up some basic seasonings here um onion garlic thyme and some tomatoes we also have scallion and jamaican um uh, scotch bonnet pepper all right so this is what we're gonna be doing this morning and let me just be real with you guys no, it's oh we're making it with fried breadfruit all right and we have videos up on our playlist how to roast breadfruit and how to fry it so what has happened is that the breadfruit has been roasted it has been cut up into wedges and it's now being prepared to fry all right so you can have it like this roasted like that but most Jamaicans after you roast it and if it has been um, if it is not consumed immediately as a roast breadfruit uh, as roasted breadfruit it is then um, saved and fried all right so this is our take this morning and over there let me just show you I have some melon skin with some ginger that I shall be juicing yes melon skin watermelon skins yeah with ginger yes antioxidant and all these things but that's a far different kettle of fish we're not trouble that over there so that's the big man thing you know all right what you guys favorite color loo dish like fried dumpling etc well um, what you like your color loo with dibs soft green bananas crushed soft green bananas crushed is what we like we our like color with. with me like it with chicken <laughs> by the way normally mm. i don't i don't usually cook color without any kind of salt fish on them something and we don't have any today because of the quarantine so yeah all right when i'm not salt fish but we let me tell you guys you can put color you can add other things to your color all right for instance you can add sausage if you have um ham you can add ham you can add you know whatever protein you want to to your color to embellish it mm -hmm. um or you can just go with the nice color as it is the you know um version. you can add sausage um, um simone just says uh Troy says oh thank you for turning me on to ba basmatic rice <laughs> and, so, uh, getting, <laughs> and spinach and shrimp what you gone far now try with spinach and shrimp in it too yeah color low with selfish and yellow yam tishana tishana mm -hmm. um that's a good one too selfish and yellow yam but we never get no selfish because with the line thing giant lining for buy things not really appeal to us that much right now so we we'll make do with what we have. This looks so nice. It looks good. Grill, but separately, yes. I thought of that. I thought of sardine separate. You want you want me to do something separate? Okay. You know, show the people in your face. Your hairstyle yeah. looks so beautiful. You need the people to see you. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. Look at this beautiful beauty. You're so beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> oh, your shirt look good. Oh, yeah, the belly TV. Oh, guys, you can get the shirt. Yeah. Click the shop no button and you can get this shirt. Yeah, the belly TV. Yes, yeah, a beautiful shirt. Yes, and it has, yeah, see that? Yardy lifestyle. Yes, it, August is coming up. Independence coming up. You can represent your country with your yeah, the belly t shirt. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. And if you are beautiful like this beautiful lady right there, oh my God, you're so beautiful. Oh, girl, work it. Wreck it, wreck it, girl, wreck it, wreck it. I'm back, ladies and gentlemen. I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. All right, baby, take it away. Take it away, baby. Take it you away. Have a try for fix with this man. How often I can work. <laughs> See, you want to use. I need somebody to teach me how to stay vex with your husband. <laughs> I need to learn. You want to use this or you want to use this big pot? That. 
The one that I put up. Because this is gonna be like, I I, I prefer this. Okay. We gonna cook all of it. Because we're gonna do the the plantains and the the breadfruit in this. Okay. Yeah. Um. Send me a, a message. <laughs> all right. So the food time now. Food time now, Mr. Food time now. Hey, hey, yup, yup. Yeah, man, the hair tutorial for this style is actually definitely on my channel, Natural Hair Namics. So, and I love this hair style. I, I must say, I like the longer mm -hmm. one, mm -hmm. but I do like this yours. is a quarantine version one because yeah, it's, like it's, it's very light and you know, easy to wear, light and fluffy. <laughs> <laughs> So you, you want the, you want me to cook up something else real quick, but maybe are you good? We're good, we're good. Okay. Yeah, that's my YouTube, so check that out. All right, so the food time now. The pot is being um, heated, and so the first thing will be the seasoning. Eh, 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 eh. I'm using the smaller pot. Wow, somebody said you will look great this morning. The Thank this, you. The, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> Dana, <laughs> thank you, Dana Grace. The short hair style looks good. Thanks, John Doe. Thank you, Dana. I appreciate it. I tried to do my best with the hair. Yeah. Oh wow, YouTube is doing the most. Babe, did I tell you that? No, I'll tell you after. <laughs> My YouTube. Uh, all right. Um, coconut oil. Ready? Yeah. All right, come guys. Let's go over there. It's few time. All right, so we're using coconut oil, guys. And let me just show them. And guys, if you are, if you did not know, a, a tablespoon of this every day does prevent the virus. All right, the, mm -hmm. it has already been proven by doctors. Coconut oil has minerals in it or, or whatever ingredients in it that causes the virus to. To not be able to replicate so two mm -hmm. tablespoons of coconut oil so if you if you are in a high risk situation you can it's good otherwise it has ketones that helps to prevent diseases and sicknesses and mm -hmm. it can help you so get on that let me let me be the camera person for you baby turn it down mm -hmm. all right so and the coconut oil also is good for memory loss and all them type of some cognitive, um, you know, um, yeah, you know only help. Food. You know what my daddy used to cut up all the seasonings underneath the salad the night before. So <laughs> everything can just steam together. The time, the time always, you know. Mm -hmm. And this is a steaming process, guys. The kalalu is really being steamed. So we are not really going to be trying to saute the vegetables too much. We're just going to add the kalalu to it. You want more kalalu in that, babe? Because yeah. you know it will. It will. Yes. Yeah. Regeneration. Thank you so much. Simone. I mean, I'm going to that myself. And you cut up your kalalu, you guys, and just keep it in your fridge so you use it easy. Lynette Carter, good morning. Good morning. Where are you logging on from, guys? Remember to let us know. That's okay. Yeah. You want me to stir? Or you want to stir? Yeah, yeah. Let us stir together. Yeah. Oh. And we don't, I don't have the seasoning that we normally use. We don't have Laurie's garlic powder. Right. But we have the 21 season salute. Yeah. Um, yeah, but that's not salt based. Right. So we just add regular salt. And then 21. Um, this? Yeah. Oh, hold on. This is getting too hot. What's this, that? This over here. 21 seasoning salute. Connecticut in the house. Hey, Delaware is in the house. Hey. Oh, that's two different places. Connecticut in the house. Um, oh Springfield. Uh, or Bridgeport in Connecticut. Something fell and blocking everything. Else. All right, leave it. I'll get it. I'll get it. Don't put it back. Don't put it back. You put it on the table. I'll get it. All right. Um, what else are you putting in this, babe? Salt. 
But I'm putting in black salt. You can just use regular salt. And normally we leave we leave the salting aspect of it to the individual because sometimes no, we don't. sometimes we want um people to add their own salt if it's you not mean overly it no oh. but i mean like now that you're adding this you, oh, you're not oh, testing oh, oh. how much salt you're adding so okay i'm gonna stop stirring i like stirring huh? black pepper and guys if you have a pepper grinder that is way better than the black pepper without the grinder all right yes i did i did don't don't cut it all right i was gonna tell you just drop it in there like butter watson but you can cut it up cut it up cut it up cut it up i'm not wasting a whole pepper yeah but you're gonna use too little bit of the pepper because you're scared of pepper you need to put a whole lot of pepper in there those peppers are hot by the way did miss market get them from yeah. Them up. And we're using scotch bonnet, guys. People can add more pepper. Than Milwaukee, one. Wisconsin is in the house. Hey. Dana Graves, good morning to you. Yeah. Hey, Milwaukee is in the house. Yeah. Wisconsin is in the house. Hey, baby, baby, come on. Baby, baby, come on. Baby, baby, come on. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Somebody said they have a quiz. Lord Jesus. Alright, so we have butter, which is very important. Guys, if you're really making a Jamaican dish like this, you need butter. Alright, so this is the one aspect of it that is not vegan. Not more, more color, lo, man. What is that? It seems like it was more color, look yeah. you. Because, you know, color, might as well, we just color it up. No, we have to save something at the color rice. What about can color? Yes, yeah, man. And it want more butter too. Butter. 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 Oh, this is what my dad always used. This is a trick when cooking callaloo that I've seen my dad use. But and this is a song that my mom always sing. It says, Callaloo, 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 ya pray thee the Lord. Callaloo, callaloo. <laughs> what? No, no. I got it, babe. So let me. Oh, let me. but like how it's. We normally have. Um, so I was. Done in one, but like how we normally use saltfish. Then maybe the fish one. Can yeah, work. the fish one can work. It no matter. Yeah, my dad always put this for flavor in his callaloo. And it's nice. So I'm going to use a little bit of that. What's the quiz, Web Venture? Your Web Venture about are we making fried dumpling? Please make fried dumpling. When? Eh? When? We used to sing that at Devotion. <laughs> so, I know, guys, another thing that we need to let you guys know. Let me know. Um, okay, other than the fish one. Um, um, you're trying me now. Over baby. there. I don't see none. No? I see none. But you don't need it, baby. Okay. You don't need it. I mean, uh, you want, you want some coconut milk? Not today. Okay. That sounds very prejudicial. But I don't have a bit of water. I was just going to say that. Mm. That these nowadays colors don't spring up water. Yeah, usually when you put color in the pot, you see a ton load of water. To make the juice. But you know, I understand how foreign things don't. But, you know. A corona, corona make the, the color will stop spring water. Stop blame corona. Every me on Corona from me here when I see you water. Blame it on Corona. Oh, you know you could use some of this. No. Wow. I feel hurt. Do you see any? No, I don't. I don't see any. I don't see any. I'm sorry. All right, let me taste it, guys, for saltiness. Cause you don't want to eat bland callalo at the same time. You understand me? Oh yeah, colorado fritters. I don't think I've made that, but it's great for fritters too, yeah. I'm gonna make some colorado fritters tomorrow on Friday, Friday, Friday. Hold it. She just bad me up, so that's what I can't take in on this body not behavior. You understand? No, guys, guys, you all don't know what a husband have to go through when the wife decides to body him up and tell him, oh, no, I don't want that in it. Because oh, let me tell you the difference between me and her. 
I am the guy who will always be experimenting. I, I dabble with flavors and tastes and stuff. She is to a T. So it's always a little bit of a tug of war between us. Uh -huh. Can you throw this away? Why? We need to leave this something that the things in now, but you're not in Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Jesus' name. All oh, the joy that come from Jesus' name. Jesus' name. All oh, the top of the lives in Jesus' name. Jesus' name. She only real Jamaicans know that song. Eh? Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Oh, the power that lies in Jesus' name. LaShawn, good morning to you. LaShawn is in the house. Oh, Lala is in the house. Oh, hey, baby, 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 come on, baby. baby, baby come on. All right. No, I'm going to stop the foolishness. FYI, I did put the I'm going to be serious for the rest of our vlog, okay? Seriousness. All right. Oh, seriousness. Ready to do this part? See the cut this skeleton. Want me cut this skeleton? Why not put it full? No. Oh, water. You leave the camera unmanned. Unmanned? <laughs> unmanned. The camera is unmanned, you guys. We will be back. You need to do the, the sponsorship now. Oh, we didn't put any butter. Just put the water there. You need to put the sponsorship now. Wait, wait. I'm Guys, I'm coming. She's bothering me. She don't want to do what I say. All right, cool. That's good. Go ahead now. Go. All right, guys. Good morning. Good morning again, again. And now that we're in the interim, It's sponsorship time, you guys. Sponsorship time. Sponsorship time. And first of all, let me say thanks to those who have, you know, supported One True Natural. Don't pay the breadfruit any attention. Ignore the breadfruit right now. <laughs> it's all about One True Natural right now. Okay? Ignore the breadfruit. <laughs> Ignore the breadfruit. You love singing, huh? Don't pay no attention. All right, guys, so today's video is brought to you by none other than One True Natural. One True Natural is our natural hair product line. And yes, we will be expanding pretty soon. Pray, How about that? pray for us. Yeah. Or more. Let me see. That's fine. Yeah. Anyway, so the three products that we currently have in our product line is one the flagship product which is our shine of mine and this is a nourishing oil blend and if you guys can see the ingredients it is a blend of amazing oils such as extra virgin olive oil sweet almond oil grapeseed oil coconut oil jamaican black castor oil and a lots of love and a blend of essential oils for fragrance so this is amazing for the scalp it's amazing to to lock in the moisture in your hair whenever you moisturize your hair it adds shine and it can be used as a hot oil treatment it's also amazing for the skin yeah also amazing for the skin so you need to check this one out and guys i think it's um i don't know if it's me only but the tendency is, if you don't catch yourself and um, ad ad address it, the tendency is to neglect your hair. You just probably have your hair in a ponytail or something for the entire time, being quarantined. And if you do not um, pay attention, you guys will end up neglecting your hair. But you need to make sure your hair is healthy. So yeah, one true natural is the way to go. We also have the big dog, yes. The pure Jamaican black castor oil and I proudly declare that this is a farm to shelf product this doesn't go into anybody's factory it is not processed nothing else is added it's the plain 
unadulterated Jamaican black castor oil and this is amazing for growth and it's amazing for thickness and this i can tell you guys is one of the only oils that actually moisturize your hair if you guys don't have moisturizer and you try to moisturize your hair with um regular traditional oils it will just sit on top but this is very moisturizing very thick authentic you can see thickness of the oil and the color yeah and it's very very good for my ear and this has been helping to grow in your belly's beard so yeah don't sleep on this this is for guys too all right so my beard is so thick and nice also guys if you're having problems with your um Smokes. regularity oh, sorry 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 <laughs> <laughs> you still problems with your spouse if you're having problems being regular a half a teaspoon of this thing will actually get your bowels in motion so yeah this is something that jamaican parents would typically do back in the day when you're a child so yeah anyway the final product in the line is our one true natural castor oil mascara and this is a brow and lash growth and thickening treatment it has a typical wand a mascara wand that you use to apply the product and this has been giving um awesome results i've been getting rave reviews from my clients especially those who used to wear lashes a lot Their lashes are now sparse they have been seeing you know the lashes growing in from using this product so yeah one true natural you guys the sponsor for breakfast live <laughs> the yard of belly tv go to my instagram page one true natural or visit the website at www.etsy.com slash shop slash one true natural and place your order today yay 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 that's so <laughs> good baby that's so good Let me quickly type, I'm typing the website. Hold on, no, hold on. All right, so I'm gonna just type in the website. If, would it allow? On my, on yeah. Okay, www.etsy.com slash shop. Slash one true natural. Or if you go to the if you go to the Instagram page, the shop link is right there in the bio. And it's in our description box for this video. Yes. It's also in the description the description box for this video. Alright, so let me ask you a question, C. Yeah. I know everybody have anxieties during this time. What is your anxiety? Can you share? What's been the most, My... the most, you know, um, the diff most difficult part of this exercise, this whole time? Hmm. The most difficult part of this time, other than the, the financial impact, yeah, because we can't, we can't negate, negate. that, mm -hmm. because that's really real for, for me in particular, because of the nature of my work, I'm a hairstylist, who works from home, so you guys know the challenge with with that i had to almost immediately once the lockdown started i had to shut down my operations not only from my own you know concern of safety but the government ordered it so you know even though i work from home and i could have you know probably continued to do it but it's just not safe there's no way to social distance as a hairstylist as a nail tech as a, you know those personal mm -hmm. you know care um, service people there's no way to social distance so I made good sense prevail and I had to shut that down over a month ago so that's an impact but other than that I it, it's just it's just a, in, information overload has been causing a little bit of anxiety for me because every single day you see a different video the news is saying something different, different schools of thoughts, conspiracies, you you name it, 
it's just coming at you every single day and to be honest with you guys I have not looked at the news in in two weeks and it has been doing great things for my mental health yes I mean I see videos coming in, in my phone sometimes and I watch them but yeah I would just say it's been affecting me in terms of just you know fear of the unknown you know not knowing what will happen as a result we know that it will never ever be normal again we won't ever get back to a sense of normalcy business as we knew it but yeah That's okay yeah. okay what are some of the anxieties um that you guys have out there yeah you know? we would love to know how has this thing been affecting you is is it something that's been affecting you in terms of making you anxious has it affected you financially are you guys still at work have you guys seen any change in your kids? How are they dealing with it? You know, this is a. I have a newborn niece and a 95 year old grandma, and I haven't been able to visit. You see, that's that's another thing about it. The the impact that it has on you know, families, pe families friends, people not being able to to actually visit with their loved ones and spend time with their loved, and especially if the person is sick. Can you imagine that? If you have somebody who, God forbid, got sick, the worst part of it is that you, you're not able to spend any type of time, you know, with that person. So, that is rough. I can't even imagine that. You're a great PR person for your products. Please do me a favor. Push those hoodies so the big brother man <laughs> like me can find out more information about them. You mean what? You mean your the hood is on your page? Mm -hmm. Oh 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 oh. <laughs> no, Josh is the PR PR person for the hoodies. So the next time that we're on, Josh will be the PR rep mm -hmm. for the clothing line. Yeah, he's the clothing line PR person. So yeah, John Doe said, "Lost my job. Worry about what will be left after." Wow. 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 Prayer Kid, enjoy the family and life. Thank you, Prayer Kid. Um, Odin says, God forbid, but better you lose a job than your life, bro. True yes. That. True that. True that. And that was a decision that I had to make and a lot of people have to make. Are you willing to risk earning a dollar and um, losing your life? And then you have some people who are not qualified for any type of stimulus. Yeah, there you are know, people. That's another thing because, you know... They, they, well, they... the people who are not qualified for any type of stimulus would be the people who either they don't keep the law because they don't pay their taxes or they make too much to, to, to qualify for it. Mm -hmm. You understand? So you have to be definitely making like over 75000 a month. A month? Yeah in order to not get a stimulus so i would want to think that if that's your position then you're probably not going to die if you don't get the stimulus i don't know i'm just thinking you want to come show my the, the, the thing all right am i doing a good job food time yeah man i love the color you're doing an amazing job she's um feels so proud yeah. spot my blush <laughs> You want me blush? Amazing. <laughs> oh, no. This one must take out now. Mm -hmm. Alright. I can't pronounce this name. Larry. Appalling. I also work in the hospital and the families are unable to see their loved ones whom are admitted. It's tough to witness those conversations between the the medical the staff sick. and mm -hmm. the families. Wow. Who turn up at the hospital. Mm-hmm. Wow. We live like Bob. Don't worry about a thing. <laughs> <laughs> right? Good good approach, prayer kid. And so guys, with the breadfruit, what you want to do is you just want to crisp them up. To over fry them because sometimes they can become too crispy and you're not trying to make breadfruit chips, mm -hmm. so to speak. You just want to, to give them a nice color and make it more palatable. Mm -hmm. uh, this is the stage where I would dab a little salt on them. It's not a must. You don't have to, especially if you're watching your blood pressure. 
-hmm. you know but you want to and i and the oil that i'm using is sunflower oil blend with um, olive oil and i did add a little bit of coconut oil in it and that's why you see a little bit of a bubbling um or frothiness going on at the edges that's the coconut oil mm -hmm. all right <laughs> i have a delivery put my plate in the mailbox <laughs> <laughs> lala <laughs> yes girl lala you come down for you talk your mind you know lala talk <laughs> put my plate to the side that bread fruit <laughs> <laughs> All right, Carleen says, I'm a nurse and have no choice but to work, so we have to just keep praying for those in the front line. I lost my uncle in New York and have a sick family. Keep praying, everyone. Wow. Wow. Oh, and speaking about praying, we will be doing, based on the request of one of the, the subscribers who requested that we put in you know a little bit of prayer so maybe tomorrow morning we'll be doing yeah a live prayer maybe yeah tomorrow saturday morning or uh, yeah, tomorrow or saturday so if you are a faith based, um, based person. person or you know you believe in christ who is the person we pray to then you are welcome to join well, we pray to god <laughs> mm -hmm. through christ yeah um so and yes. this is this is not trying to tomorrow is friday yeah tomorrow is friday why well, i'm saying saturday because mm, yeah. we're not we're not aware of the days no more I you know. know see you know guys if we're not careful we stay up till five o'clock in the morning and then sleep through the whole day i think it's all a plan i don't mean, know i've never been <laughs> waking up so late in my entire life i don't know you know this 11 o'clock waking up and stuff and by the time you look around the time the day is done Mm -hmm. you know but we really wanna we really wanna you know send concerns especially to those who have lost loved ones you know we have listeners and viewers who have lost loved ones and we are our, our heart goes out to you guys it's it's a tough thing mm -hmm. you know to lose a loved one and then also to not be able to put them them away correctly because of the limitations on funerals and stuff like that you can't even me to to you know to uh to mourn co correctly you know mm -hmm. that too lynette says you're looking after one of my favorite dish <laughs> thank you lynette John Doe, on the upside, I've used the time to deepen my spiritual practice. That's been a blessing. Awesome. Awesome. Well, I found you and prayer is very important to me. To hear you saying that, I am very thankful. I was looking up recipes and found your channel and subscribed to it. Where are you guys at now? We are located in Miami and we are on every week. You know, multiple times we go live multiple times throughout the week, but we have a scheduled live that is on every Thursday morning at 10 a.m. where we just do like a breakfast, you know, mm -hmm. or like a Jamaican thing and, and stuff. And we try to share with everybody a slice of our culture, especially for those who are not home who miss it and miss, you know, the Jamaican way of life. Um, yeah. There is a concern that I saw about um, Atlanta and the fact that they open, they, they're planning to open um, certain businesses in Atlanta. Tomorrow, right? Yeah, tomorrow. And guys, I, I want to say this. If tomorrow morning they open the hairdressing salon, please, ladies and gentlemen, don't run go down to the hairdressing salon at the same time. Because we have to be aware that some things are not done for your benefit. Mm -hmm. How, do, how do the virus was there and then by t it, tomorrow it's it's fine to come yeah. out you yeah know, you have to be take extra precaution. sometimes sometimes people do things for, for you as you as a as a as a, a, a scapegoat a pig, yeah. or a guinea pig you know let's open the business them and see who get the virus quick you know and so be careful in everything that you guys are doing be careful and be aware that not everything that is done by those in in in, in charge Mm. Are, is being done for your particular benefit or even your race mm -hmm. you know sometimes them use it there there, there was a, a group of men who were given um i think it was smallpox by by scientists in in atlanta for years the tuskegee 
um, people in Tuskegee and, and, and they were for years being experimented on. Many of them died and they didn't know that they were being experimented on. Go to the doctor and the doctor keep giving them placebo and giving them different things to see what works. Mm -hmm. And the men died. Wow. You know? So, I think it's time to go natural. Yeah? Because... <laughs> Some of us as men really want our, our wives to go natural because you keep going to the hairdressing salon and come back, your hair don't look no different to us. Men don't notice them thing there so much. And the ladies them come back and say, oh my hair look, and, and we ex you expect us to answer, we don't know how it look, because we never know how it look when you go. We weren't paying attention. You know, so for the me for on behalf of all the men, we beseech you. <laughs> Go natural. <laughs> Why? Morning, Anis King. Good morning. Morning to you. Sunflower, flower grow on the sun. <laughs> I'm glad my head ball. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> good. Kimberly, great. I'm in North Carolina. We have a Jamaican family as part of our prayer team. My husband is from Ghana. Our pasta is from Ivory Coast, so I love all kinds of international dishes. Awesome sauce. All right, babes, we're going to get ready to, to play it. Mm -hmm. All right, let me take this off. Put this over here. Mind you make the camera get hot, babes. Oh, yeah, and zoom. Zoom in, zoom in. And so once the breadfruit has gotten to this nice golden brown stage, you're pretty much ready to Eat. take them out. And all I've added to the breadfruit is a little sprinkling of salt. Mm -hmm. That's it. Nothing else. And you keep the flames at a little bit below medium so that you can control, you know, see this one stay too long. Why that always happen to the last set of I breakthrough? know. You know, because they're tired. They get tired in on camera. Mm -hmm. Or, you know, the time gets up on you. So by the time you're taking out others, others are overcooking. Right. All right. Let me take them home. Me love breadfruit, but I don't like when it, what? It has too much oil. That's why I put it on absorbent paper. Mm -hmm. Guess what? You, th and this is my observation, and I stick and stand by it. It's that sometimes when you're frying something in a little bit of oil, especially breadfruit, do the experiment. Try to fry breadfruit in a small amount of oil and tell me what happens. The oil just get absorbed immediately, and you find yourself have to be tipping extra, extra oil. But if you put like a generous amount, you see oil still in the pan after frying. And we did not deep fry them or nothing yeah like so just... i find especially with breadfruit that that happens yeah all right it's time for the plating time flying man it's almost an hour almost an hour time flies when you're having fun whoops sorry we to drop the breadfruit mm -mm. the camera almost fall All right, now we have to turn that one off and we're ready. See, hmm? do we just put the color load in a container and then put the container in the center and then put the bread to brown it? Sounds good, like an idea. Like so? Yeah. Oh, you like that thing? Which one you want to use? Yeah, 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 use it. You can use the one that matches it though. This matches it. It's the same color and everything. Josh, Josh only emerged. Let me tell you when Josh is right about now that the food is shared, you're likely to see him emerge Just from his room. Here. Yeah, his class, his class, and the time when the food finish cook are synced. <laughs> so yeah, don't be surprised if he if he comes Fair out. Now. Yeah. He will arrive for lunch on six. See? Yeah, them know him. Need some, right. What kind of plant lash on? Right planting, right? I like 
ca- um, callaloo with a little ripe plantain. No matter what else I'm eating it with, ripe plantain and callaloo is the bomb. Ripe plantain and callaloo. Okay, and during the prayer show, but once pray done, bag of laughter start. <laughs> <laughs> I suck. Try. So true. When I was in Ghana, I felt so much better. The food, the air, and the stress. And stress free. We were just watching some um, YouTube videos in, in Africa, right? Mm-hmm. Namibia. Namibia. It's so interesting how they eat. The Harare people. They eat. I don't know. They eat the, the food in its prime, mm, prime, raw, state. authentic state. Not raw as in uncooked, you know. It's but they primal. primal state. Like they, they put limited amount of seasonings on their food. And they don't cook it in no saucy sauce and nothing. And no gravy, gravy, nothing. A lot of it is just roasted. Yeah. So I, we were kind of having a conversation last night as to whether, you know, the food is healthy. But I think it's healthier that way because the less seasonings and the less sauces, I think the food is healthier. Yes, breakfast looking delicious. Thanks, Paula Murray. Thank you. Yes, was the. Tuskegee experience in Alabama. That was in Alabama. Oh, the Tuskegee. The more nutrients, right, Simone? Is that to a brushet? <laughs> and Ram, I haven't heard brushet in a while. No, the lighter ones, please. D- why? Why? Help me. Oops. And guys, we're just doing this for the for the um presentation. Not for the lights, you know, just for the presentation. <laughs> <laughs> we do it for the love. Do it for the love. Do it for the love. Nice Dutch pot. <laughs> Thank you. We buy that Dutch pot. They miss Mark. I think we buy that Dutch pot. You know. Paula said, "I love when you guys sing." I think it's my voice, Paula. Uh, wow. It's me. It's me, Paula, like when they sing in me. <laughs> Paula love when they sing because we just sing so All nice. right, Paula, tell me where you're logging in from. I'm going to sing for you. <laughs> where you're logging in from. Hello, guys. D Stafford says, hello, guys. I love watching y'all. Hey, D. It all looks yummy. I am diabetic. Aww. Well, you know what? This is an awesome dish for you. The, um, the Kalaloo. It's awesome. No meat today. We are meat free, so this would be a great dish for you. Yeah. And that is it. You want a tomato cut up on the side there, in there, anywhere there? Or are you good without the tomato? It's good without the tomato, right? Yeah. Show the show the dish. Show the, the thing. You're not showing the thing. Pembroke Road in the house. Florida is in the house. Hey. Watch out. Look who turn up. Look who turn up. Same class over. It's over. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the one who is craving. What? <laughs> we are my class done. Lord of mercy. Mm-hmm. We have mommy phone for me. Yeah. Breakfast, you guys. <laughs> oh, that look. It look good, babes? Mm-hmm. With the pepper pan the top. Breakfast is done now. Yes, uh, I will put some scallions on top. Mm-hmm. Why you get the taste? It tastes so good. Mm-mm. <laughs> wow. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Jamaican awesome. one said bread fruit make you coward. Hello, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, some here, some here. 
Breakfast is my new girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Janice Jones. Hi. Just lovely. Anis, you're making me hungry now. <laughs> Debbie, it looks delicious. Try cinnamon, nutmeg, honey, breadfruit. Watch an image. Try, man. <laughs> Miss uh, Try, can we go over the top with him, him recipes, you see, man? I just realized that I don't see Akino in the chat in a long time. He must work, he must work in my essential service. Mm hmm. But, but you still have him when you work. Yeah, but his lovely wife has been here holding down the food, so mind what you say. <laughs> Carla, you guys are from the main. Yeah, man. We are authentic. You know, you're the, the part one. Authentic. We're authentic. Jamaican, yeah, the people. Hence, yeah, the people. Kalaloo, 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 praise the Lord. Kalaloo, Kalaloo, Kalaloo. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. For the five bread fruit. Praise the Lord. The hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. For the fried bread fruit and hallelujah. That was my video for Instagram. So if you are on my Instagram, you will hear that song. And I, I I'm gonna, I'm working on the management now. So I soon get the manager to, <laughs> you know, um, support. The, you know. Rosemary says she convinced that Josh to live while I'm in the room to see. Of course, he, 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 <laughs> guys, Josh is on the live as Web Venture, and he came on asking about fry fry dumpling, cause him love fry dumpling. Mm -mm -mm. John Doe said, make a plate. Um, I'm sorry? John Doe want a plate? Make a plate. Make a plate. Make a plate, my brother. Make a plate. I'll make a plate. All right, see, grab, grab, a, grab a plate. And, and, and um, you're going you're gonna to move down a little bit or no? Paula Morris has sent some for me. Tanya Johnson. Tanya? Tanya is in the house. Make a... Um, the cream is singing that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Tanya, liberty I take with me now. Tanya is taking liberties with me. Yeah, that's done. Here you go, baby. Grab a little plate, because you have to sample it and let the people them know if the food tastes good. That's what I say. And we got three minutes left. Kimberly, thank you, Kimberly. I'm entering, uh, try say my enter this in the Yard Belly um, Museum, food museum right away. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And there is the lovely, beautiful I lady took the ones, I like in them. her Yard Belly um, t shirt. Let me adjust the camera so that you can see her. Please don't look at the background of my house, just look on she. You know, just by saying that, everybody looking in the background. <laughs> Please stop looking in the background of my house. Just look on her while she devours. You might as well have said, look in the background. <laughs> the crispiness of the food. It could take a little more salt, but we're good with, that, with, with it how it is. As he said, you can. Can I get a fork, please? Oh, no. Let me show you the strategy. You don't need a fork. You do like this. And then you go so. And scoop it. You take it and do so. <laughs> That's how you do it. You can't talk with your mouth full. I'm not talking. I'm humming. Mm. Mm -mm. It is so good. Oh my lord. It has a nice coconut flavor. Mm -hmm. I told you Just want more pepper. Grow, right? What about what I love about Kalalu is how fast it grows. Yes, Giovanni. Really? Mm hmm. Oh. Blessings, Giovanni. Big up yourself, youth. Long time, yeah. Joshua, go and go look at food. Hmm? Go and go look up some food. Joshua has emerged. Joshua class done. May I call him teacher and ask her if she watch your breakfast live? Because I don't know she out class as soon as the breakfast ready. <laughs> Janice Jones says a colorless sandwich. Janice, you know. You know a colorless sandwich. 
Bread, Kalalu, and bread. Oh my lord. Bread, Kalalu, planting. Oh yes, oh yeah, planting. In the middle of all of that with the planting. Oh my lord, that is real Jamaican picnic. And we couldn't complain. We have to wax off that quick, quick when we get that for Algo School. Yep, yep, yep. So, guys, thank you once again for joining us today. Thank you for joining us. Yeah, um, somebody a thief. You can't have thief on camera. They must see Um, No, it's, it's, it's your mom I'm talking. Thank you for joining us today. Josh around here, so hustling him food. Guys, stay safe during this time. And we, we do pray for all those who shared about their particular concerns. Father, we pray that you cover your people right now under your blood. We pray that you provide safety for them. We pray that you meet their needs financially. As they turn to you, Lord God, may your glory be seen and be felt in their hearts and in their minds. We pray that those who don't know you and may have been moving astray from you will turn quickly to your redeeming love and that you will save them immediately. Father, thank you once again, and we give you praise and honor and glory in Jesus' name. Amen. Mm -hmm. Guys, thank you for joining us. It's been our pleasure to have you on this morning, and we are really and truly grateful to each and everyone who shared with us. And uh, hey, look out for us, man. We might be live tomorrow morning again with another live with a prayer time, whatever the Lord leads on our hearts to do. Keep the bell rung so that you know when we are on. And for the rest of the time, it's just we and the hallelujah are going to make it happen in Jesus' name. Thank you once again. Blessings to you. Thank you guys for your orders. Thank you for your orders on our Etsy. We appreciate you and love you for that. Thank you so much. I remember to click the Shop Now page to see if you like any of my t-shirt designs on Yardabella TV. Yes, you may get a nice one for Independence. They have some really good ones, Jamaica t-shirts on my shop. So thank you. Blessings again. Peace and love. And remember, live and laugh, cook and eat. <laughs> Try to say my own manager. <laughs>